talk of another recession is becoming more than just chatter lately. Now, it's unclear whether it will happen, but if it does, the Fox 5 I team's Dana File tells you you don't have to take it lying down. you got everybody's attention at this point. you got to put up a little bit of a fight here. Yeah. <laughs> you can start by trying to insulate yourself from the hit, but first, let's lay a little bit of groundwork for why we're even hearing about this recession chatter again. Last week, we had financial planning expert Mark Lloyd on who told us a whole lot is happening. Let's start with China, the world's second largest economy is suffering. The world's big banks, they're talking about instituting, listen to this, negative interest rates. And then there's the election season, which historically he says is a real kidney punch to the economy. There's always uncertainty during election year because Wall Street wants direction. They want certainty. So when you like in this election cycle, this has been really off the yeah, charts. Right, right. We don't even know who the front runners are at this right. point. And boy, that hasn't changed since last week, has it? Well, the good news is that post-election, the economy gets a little bit of a boost no matter who's elected, which party. But there's a lot of time, of course, between now and then. So how can you protect yourself if, if we dip into another recession? Start saving. If you lose your job and you have to dip into your emergency fund, you're going to want enough cash there to be able to cover your bills for at least three months while you're out of work. The ideal emergency fund is nine months, but do what you can do. Get your resume ready. Have it ready to go just in case. It's also a good time to remind yourself of your skills. And yes, you do have them. Don't underestimate yourself. And Honestly, it goes without saying, but I'm going to say it. Focus on getting rid of that credit card debt and live for a while like you know a recession will hit and that you're going to lose your job. What I heard in that was a big <laughs> if. if. There, there's no, no one saying it's going to happen. There are folks who say it's absolutely going to happen. There are folks saying it's going to happen, but it'll be recession light six to 12 months. Then there are voices saying that there are plenty of optimism out there. Lots of optimists saying, ah, probably not. But there are certainly enough things happening that can mm. add up to a recession. We've been through this before. Just insulate yourself a little bit. Just get a little ready, just in case. I like it. Don't panic. I like it. All right, Dana, mm -hmm. thank you.